And time now for a segment brought to you by Grand Lodge of Rhode Island Freemasons. Here to tell us more about the organization is Douglas Grant, who is the Deputy, Deputy Grand Master of Masons for the state of Rhode Island, along with uh, Melvin Sil Silverio, who is the Master Largio Libertad. Good morning, folks. Thanks so much for coming in. Good morning. Good morning. Great to see you. I'm going to start with you, if I can, Douglas. Just give us a little background about the, the Masons themselves. Sure. Because uh, you're a veteran. You've been with them for a long time. <laughs> yeah, uh, relatively. Uh, yeah. We have many more that have been here for over 50 years. Wow. So, uh, yeah, Freemasonry in Rhode Island is a fraternal organization of men that uh, come together to uh, be friendly, uh, camaraderie, uh, provide charity, uh, we provide scholarships, we do a whole bunch of different things in the local communities. Right. The Grand Lodge of Rhode Island is the hub of Freemasonry, and underneath that are 23 active lodges. Got it. And Melvin, that's where you come in because you've been you've been part of the organization for what did you say, ten years? Yes, I have been in for ten years. Right. And tell us about uh, tell us about the lodge that you belong to. Uh, well, we are actually uh, the first Spanish speaking lodge in the state, um, and we are the first working lodge, uh, new lodge, um, in over sixty years. Right. Wow. We had sixty years we hadn't created a new lodge. Here we go. And here we are. So for you, Melvin, I mean, what was it about the, the Freemasons that made you want to join 10 years ago? Oh, well, I, w I, am, a, I am an Army veteran. Okay. Um, and one of the things that I was looking for as I returned home uh, was the Brotherhood. Mm -hmm. um, and I definitely found it here, um, and I am glad I joined. <laughs> yeah, that's great. And, and, and they really do. They do incredible work through, yes. throughout the state as well. Now, the... Um, the lodge uh, conferred its first uh, first degree on a candidate. So, can you tell me what that what that means? Uh, it means we took them through an initiation, okay. basically, um, and we they basically uh, get to know a little bit more about the fraternity, um, and we start teaching them about certain uh, things that we do in lodge. Uh, it was great. Yeah, it really it really is. Now, um, tell us about the age group that can actually join. Yeah, actually, it's anyone, uh, any man that's 21 years or older. Okay. And uh, we have Masons, and we have active Masons, ranging from 21 years all the way up to 96 years. Wow. Yeah. Wow. yeah. yeah. So yeah. you're like a spring, you guys are like spring I, chickens. I feel young now. <laughs> you do feel young. And yeah. you were mentioning a lot of the great work that, that you guys do. Can you tell everybody about that? Sure. Uh, on a local level, from the lodge level, they uh, partner up with local food banks and pantries and so forth and provide assistance for them. From the Grand Lodge perspective, we provide funds sometimes to the lodges, but also we, we partner up with the Rhode Island Food Bank, okay. the Milk Fund in Woonsocket, uh, the food pantry down in uh, Newport, uh, Portsmouth area, sure. that actually works right out of the lodge. Oh, okay. Yeah, and we also provide uh, tremendous scholarships for people who live in Rhode Island. Right, and I know there's also things for, for folks who need, uh, need uh, equ equipment to, who are yes, disabled, exactly. something like yeah. that. The Robert and, Allen Medical Center. Yeah, and yeah. That is a great, that's a great thing for a lot of folks as it's well. fantastic. Yeah. Guys, thanks so much for, for joining us today. This segment was brought to you by Grand Lodge of Rhode Island Freemasons. To learn more, you can visit roadshow.com.